Oxford City and Oxford University. It must be a proud moment for you, actually. It is. Um, it's, it's been, I've been at the club obviously 20 plus years and uh, there's been a lot of talk about trying to establish connections and build partnerships. Um, and I think in the last sort of two to three years, we've made massive strides forward and you know, what an amazing institute the University of Oxford is, world leading, um, on our doorstep as well, of course. Um, and, but also the conversations we've had, we, we realise that Oxford City has an important part to play as well in, in terms of connecting with the Oxford community. Um, you know, we have a lot of access to individuals that play, coach, manage, spectate. Um, yeah, so I'm really excited with the, the, the prospect of, of getting, uh, getting on with a partnership and working together. We're really delighted to have this partnership between the University of Oxford and Oxford City Football Club. Oxford City Football Club is a fantastic community club. The impact it has on kids and communities across our city is really significant. And we've got this long-standing history. Oxford City was traditionally a club supported by staff and students across the university, as well as by the wider community. We've obviously had this huge history of the White House ground just off the Abingdon Road being the traditional home of Oxford City, previously owned by Brasenose College. Oxford City spent many years out in the wilderness and we're delighted to be bringing the university and the club back together. Through this you know, our aspirations have always been to support young people, um, <laughs> to work through education programmes and develop education. Uh, and also research as well, and we're, we're actively involved in a few projects already. Um, but yeah, it, it all aligns to what our vision is, um, and uh, can only elevate the club, and yeah, the shirts are fan absolutely fantastic. So, uh, and having the brand on the front is, is, is absolutely brilliant. But it's just really the most visible part of a deeper partnership. The university and the club have been working together for some time. We work together on research, whether it's mathematicians, PhD mathematicians working on data analysis on the playing side, whether it's our football on the brain team from neuroscience working with the club. We work together on education programmes and this season, really excitingly, we're going to be offering a certificate programme in character-based leadership to members of the men and women's first team and delivering those educational opportunities and we want to broaden it. We've been sharing facilities as well, so having the first team training on some of our college pitches, this team, having some of our teams use the facilities at Marsh Lane, there's already that collaboration and we want to deepen it. Yeah. I think the brand on the back's interesting as well because you've got a, a company from Japan, the Asian uh, football community and a respected local business, it's a great combination. Absolutely and uh, you know I think it's, it's, it's fantastic to see both male and female um, kits being sponsored uh, and yeah we're, we're equally passionate about both um, the development of the female game is huge uh, we've got over 300 female players at the moment so uh, and, and long may that continue uh, so yeah massively excited and uh, yeah fun roots um, and the, the president of fun roots uh, mr Hirano, has come over today uh, it's great to see him uh, he is connected not just in japan but um, within Europe, uh, and there's going to be lots of opportunities for, for our young players. To, we already sent one team to Tokyo a couple of years ago, so uh, exchanges, tournaments, festivals, sharing good practice. Um, but yeah, absolutely, um, what an opportunity for us as a football club. We want to get beyond town and gown, recognise that the university is an integrated part of the city and the county, and that we want people to recognise that the university is a collaborator, a partner, and that sport can be a way of building bridges.